Spell Check and Grammar Spell Check is a very intelligent feature of MS Word 2010. It checks your spelling while you are working on your document. It shows the wrongly spelt word by a red wavy underline. The wavy line which you noticed under the text Whipple was an error caught by Spell Check. Even your name will give a Spell Check error. MS Word 2010 does not have the spelling of your name in its dictionary. That's why it shows it as a spelling mistake. Similarly, other spelling mistakes will be shown in the same way. To rectify your spelling mistakes, the steps are as follows. Step 1. Right click on the red wavy underlined word. You will be shown with many options as the correct spelling of this word. Step 2. From these options, you may choose the correct spelling of the word. Clicking on the correct word will itself replace the incorrect word in the document. Here, alignment is an incorrect word and gave a spell check error. Choose alignment as a correct word. There is also one more option as add to dictionary, shown in the option list. This may be used in case of your name. You can add your name to dictionary so that MS Word 2010 may not give a spell check error to your name in future. Just like the spell check, MS Word 2010 also looks for the grammar of text blocks. This is another intelligent feature of MS Word which helps you to identify incorrect sentences. The grammatically incorrect sentence is shown by green wavy underline. You may correct the incorrect sentences by following these steps. Step 1. Right click on the green wavy underlined sentence. You will be provided with the possible correct sentence. Step 2. Choose and click on the correct option. The grammatically incorrect sentence will get replaced with the grammatically correct sentence. There is one more way to spell and grammar check your document. The steps to spell and grammar check are as follows. Step 1. Click on the spelling and grammar command on the proofing group on the review tab. The spelling and grammar dialog box will appear. This dialog box will show all the mistakes in your document with suggested corrections one by one. Step 2. Select the correct suggestion and click on the change button to rectify your document. Clicking on the change all button will change that incorrect word or sentence in the complete document. You may ignore the mistake by clicking on ignore once button at one place and on clicking on ignore all in the whole document. Using thesaurus in addition to spell checking and grammar checking tools that MS Word 2010 offers, there is also the word thesaurus to improve the documents. The thesaurus tool in MS Word 2010 allows to select a word in the document, then look that word in the thesaurus. You can then choose from a number of synonyms offered by word and insert that in place of the selected word in the document. The steps to use the word thesaurus are as follows. Step 1. Select the word for which you wish to find the synonym. Step 2. Click on the thesaurus command on the proofing group on the review tab. The research task pane will appear. Step 3. Move the mouse pointer to the suitable word. Click on the drop down arrow right of the word and then click on the insert option. This will replace the existing word with the new word.